chapter 10 verse 25 our love for Christ you know I was talking about the heart if you remember last Sunday I was talking about the beauty of your insight I said be concerned about your inside more than your outside. Even on Wednesday, I talked about that one. Now, we look at the expert of the law when it comes to true Christianity. True Christianity lies in our heart. Now, I want to talk about our love for Christ or the love for God. Listen to 25. On one occasion, an expert in the law stood up and test Jesus. Teacher, he asked, what must I do to inherit eternal life? 26, what is written in the law? He replied, how do you read it? 27, he answered, love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your strength and with all your mind. And love your neighbor as yourself. 28. You have answered correctly, Jesus replied. Do this and you will live. 29. But he wanted to just fight. He, I mean, he wanted to justify himself, so he asked Jesus, and who is my neighbor? Who is our neighbor? Who is your neighbor? This is the question. Who is your neighbor? Who is my neighbor? Is it someone next to your house? Hmm? I'm talking to you, people of God. Who is your neighbor? Before we go back to the word love, who is your neighbor? Is it someone next to your house? If you go down, you will come across with a story about a good Samaritan. Because of time, when you go home, go and read all of it. You understand who is your neighbor. You do what? Who is your neighbor? You understand this one. When you go home, go and read all of it. There you know that, oh, my neighbor is not the next to my house. My neighbor is everyone. As long as it's your brother, it's your neighbor. And what is the meaning of this? Someone you call your neighbor is someone who, you know, will be like him in good relationship with you regardless of you know where they are coming from where they belong whether they belong to christianity or what what is important is to show them that we are there to show the love of god to everyone so whether they are coming from the other religion treat them the way you can treat your fellow christian Okay, because of time, go and read this one and you understand uh, the point. Let me go back to where I started from. Verse 25. On one occasion, an expert of the law stood up to test. To test Jesus. Teacher, he asked, what must I do to inherit eternal life? Jesus answered this man, what is written in the law? He replied, how do you read it? This is the answer from the same man who was testing Jesus. Love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your mind and with all your soul. Now, if I ask you this question, people of God, if someone can answer our Savior 
the way this man answered him. Can you doubt this man that is not a Christian? Can you doubt him that he's not a believer? According to what he said, if it is not the Holy Spirit in you, you can even conclude that this one too is a child of God. And yet, he was not. He was just a religious person using the law to pin someone. Whoever will be like, you know, no more than what they know, they will try by all means to bring him down. Jesus made him to answer by himself. Love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your mind and with all your soul and with all your strength. If you love him like that, simply means the whole entire body is for Christ. There will be no place again for Satan and his demonic activities because starting from your head up to your feet, it is Jesus. Your thinking is Jesus. Your energy is Jesus. Everything in you is Jesus. But this man was totally blank about the answer he gave Jesus. He was just reading the record. Because Jesus asked him what is written in the law. And the one you know who answered is the same man. He said, it is written, love the Lord your God with all your heart with all your mind and with all your soul. There again he said, who is my neighbor? Because all what he wants is to justify himself. Who is my neighbor? This is why now Jesus came up with this parable. He said, someone was coming from this direction to this direction and was attacked by criminals. Go and read it. We all know about the good Samaritan. If you love God with all your heart, with all your mind, with all your strength, tell me where Satan, you know, can hide within your life. Because every place of your life is occupied. Satan will try to use your mind. The mind is under the influence of the Holy Spirit. He will try to use your power to beat people. Your power is under the influence of the Holy Spirit. He will try to enter your heart. You will find that there is someone already. The Holy Ghost is there inside you. Tell me where Satan can you know, operate through your life. If you love him in such a way. And this man was talking to the Savior like he was talking to an ordinary person. It is happening even today. And if you look at the question that he asked him, he said, what can I do for me to inherit the eternal life? Even a witch is aware that there is eternal life. But they are not ready to leave their charms and start what? Following who? Jesus. Even a prostitute, everyone knew that salvation is there. Eternal life is there. But we are not ready to live our past and love God with all. The question he asks is not from someone who is under the influence of alcohol. No. An expert. You can define that word expert. You people are educated. An expert of the law. Someone who understands the law better than anyone who can interpret every letter of the law. But he was totally blind about eternal life. He doesn't know what to do for him to inherit the kingdom of God. He was asking Jesus. And he was not even serious. He was trying to see how they can bring this man down. This is the way we are joking with salvation in our time. We are not serious. We are going to church for one or two reasons. Not because we want to be saved. No. In the same way this man was asking Jesus, if you read the Bible, it says that tested him. Meaning he was not serious. It was like a trap. Let me tell you this. You are not safe. 
Lesa mufre mwa mute mwa na mano yenu yonse. Amaka yenu yonse. No mwe wenu onse. Then nishi elo mwa pwididika. Nga chakwa ati pali ififo chimu atachimu temenwe. Echi kambokulu isha filafitatu. Pali ififo chimu angata chile bombo kulinga nangefyo. Bible ilandi le nishi. Chila chine echi kateni nga genes the other three. I love Jesus. I love him. I love. Ichin ticho wate mwa. No mutima obe onse na mano yobe onse. Like if you tute mwa bana. Mwa nanangu nga wamfu wali la panemba. Nga nibanyi nefwe. Women can agree with me. You just heard your, your child is crying. Eh, eh, they will abandon everything and lash out. Eh? Who has beaten you? Why? Because ulomu ana wali mute mwate tute mwaku mfomu ana. You know what it means to be a mother. Unless it, if something is wrong with your mind. You hear your, your child is crying. You say, ah, leke ni akwati ya manu wa mchiti ya kantukula kwini. But as long as you are a mother or a father, whenever you hear your son or your daughter crying, you lash out to see what is happening. I can't even talk about girlfriend. People are killing each other because of love. I don't know if it is love. Love does not kill. If you love someone, why must you kill that person? Because of love. No, I love her so much. She, di she disappointed me. I caught her late and dead. Leave her, let the love cover that pain for you. Each time we call, if you're to watch it, even if you're listening, we na ikalamo. Fi ari chitajan, fi ari pusana. Namute mwa, namute mwa ine mwe le sawandi. Oh, namute mwa ine. Namano yandi yonse. Oh, namute mwa ine mwe le sawandi. Oh, namaka yandi yonse. Meaning, each of the chance of money in each flesh at the manani. The power of 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 the For you to love your neighbor, first of all, you need to love your creator. This is where we find it very difficult. You can't say, I love my neighbor. One day, your neighbor is going to offend you. Tell me if you continue saying I love my neighbor, you change your this uh, uh, idiot. This my neighbor is is what? Uh, this is the person you confess that I love my neighbor so much. If you love God with all your heart, with all your mind, with all your strength, with all your soul, the nature of God is completely in you. Nothing can move you outside. Your inside is pure. The nature of God is completely in you. It's like it, your appearance, yes, is you. You are a human being. But the real life is Jesus himself in you. There's nothing that you can do which Jesus cannot support. Anything that you are doing, you know for sure that my master is the one who is backing me to do this. Na mute mwalesa, no mwe wandi once, na manu yandi once. Tapadu winga kana panga na ibusha, do you love God? Everyone say yes. <laughs> I love him so much. In reality, you are not. You are not. Mwali mute mwa yesu, ah sana. Mati ndafu wano mtu wako angala kuri yesu. You are lying. With all your heart, with all your mind, with all your strength. Tell me where Satan can operate within your body. Because from the head to your feet, you are full of Jesus. Your smile is Jesus. Your walking is Jesus is walking. Anything that you are doing is Jesus doing it. You are sleeping. Who is sleeping? The flesh. Jesus is sitting down. If you look at our Savior, what made him to defeat this world? I'm sure 
kuti mwakwate swilo lyako bati o oh, kanshu kwikali la lesa no kulumbula lesa na kaona tafia bachinga chimochini bala bachilando kuti ati kuti na chitashani pa kuti mpiani obufumu wa onangulo mwe wa muya yaya elo bala ndio kuti eba fikukile nsakwe elo ngatulela ndalo muchitundu chakale we are talking about the word of god are you there yes the expert of the law meaning muntu wa ishiba fi ubupilibulo we funde tie funde lipili because aba nensu jesus aba sangire bekali la kuma funde otabale sunga bale ato bakasono badinga baya pa bantu kula we party for ni for to ben ba mafunde akantu kumye fu badu kusunga mafunde takwati umwefu we nanga mwamu ati mwati ayo cha chini ni bashikofu aba an expert of the law who could not understand what can i do for me to inherit the kingdom of god or eternal life jesus asked him what is written in the law the man answered love the lord your god with all your heart because he's an expert not of salvation but of the language are you there language the man was able to interpret language understanding your salvation was beyond his you know professional career even today there are lawyers who can interpret the law you know well well and calling the bible it doesn't mean that they are going to heaven no what can make you to go to heaven is jesus himself in you do you love him hmm? oh how i love jesus stay for twimba Mm, tefo twimba Icha chine vetu ali mutemu Na mutemwa na mutemwa ine mwele sawandi Oh na mutemwa ine Na mano ya ndi yonse Oh na mutemwa ine mwele sawandi Oh na mutemwa ine Na na mufofo nde pela kodi bwino Namano ya ndiyo nse Mwana mitemwe Mwata mlepokele la buinu Mwana mitemwe le secha chini Nga mwana mitemwe Tamufule mwana mitemwe afwe Kyo nse fi abamuli mwafile fi ate mwana ni If you go and read the story About the good Samaritan You discover that There are few today Who can say I am a child of God in reality by confession yes but when it comes to reality you are not a child of god you confess what you are not you see someone is attacked is on the ground full of blood then you just ah chimushibi oyo ah muntu uri anangu ta umushibe muntu ale chula takwete ya kusongela takwete vya kulia ati kanobo mpepa nabo kanomwa icho wandi kanomwa na wandi ha and then we learn that we are not lesa, na lesa wari mutemwa. No. Vanga wa mutemwa lesa. Can I see your hand? Uh, it's very easy. Go and pay rentals for that neighbor of yours. Eh? It is very easy. Go and buy meal meal. Akasa kano marishinga. Two fifty. Go and buy four bags of meal meal and give it to whoever is in need, if it is possible. Christianity is not just a mere confession. No, we need to placard is what we are confessing. The love of God is beyond, you know, these tribal uh, family boundaries. You can go beyond that one. If truly you love God Almighty. Amen. Thank you. God bless you.